Hello everyone, uh, my name is Skadoosh and this is going to be a quick introduction to my little world of Tug. Uh, just to give you a, an idea of how I roll through it. Um, I use the hoe to create farmland to get rid of a lot of the tall grass and give myself a large area. Um, clear it out, cut down the trees, cut down bamboo. Uh, leave of course fruit trees when I can. Um, this also helps for a couple other things. It uh, allows you to find your area when you're coming back to it a little easier. It also keeps the animals at a good distance because it seems they want to hide behind things. Uh, so even those little uh, kinecogen or whatever they're called, uh, the mushroom sprites, um, they'll stay back a ways into the, into the tall grasses. They won't come up too close so I don't get a whole lot of uh, mushrooms in my area. But anyway, this is my little building that I've built. Uh, a little shelter. <coughs> I'm still playing with it. Uh, I eventually will build a large tower of sorts. Um, I didn't quite make that fall, but uh, as you can see, I got the tower up there. Uh, so anyway, I got some melons, I got some gourds, I got some pumpkins, apple trees. I need to go find me some cherry trees and some others to kind of flesh it out. But uh, it's been fun. Um, I use the little glowing gourds and the healing potions as little decorative nuances here and there. I uh, threw in some uh, pumpkins everywhere because hey, it's, uh, it's October now and it's almost Halloween for us. And uh, here's the inside. Uh, I keep a little space here for the campfire and the cauldron and I, I kind of create a little, a little fire pit in the, in the middle here. Uh, I've got my bed all decked out with uh, lots of furs because, you know, it never gets uh, too too warm at night. You know, it's kind of cool. So stay nice and toasty there. And I've also found that using the pumpkin shells <coughs> is a good makeshift um, container uh, for various items. You can hold a lot of melons, a ton of apples, especially if they're five stacked. Uh, you got a ton of apples in there and you see the melons are four stacked. Uh, so it's a good amount. And of course, I try to try to keep up with the six stacks and as best I can on the mushrooms and whatnot. Um, so yeah, I, I also double double thicked it. Uh, it was all cobblestone, but then I added a layer of wood just to kind of give it some. I don't know, just playing around with the textures and whatnot. <coughs> keep uh, keep the trash outside so it doesn't stink up the place. That kind of thing. And I got some extras over here. Lots of gourds gourds up the stairs because you can't really see them per se and I was playing around with this trying to put stuff in the little cubby holes and whatnot but uh, didn't work out as well a few stacks of meat um, <coughs> basic storage area the wood products here strapping and leather and vines hardwoods here bamboo here various other plant materials and then extra tools and then my stones as I get through them. I love the pebble stack, that's kind of kind of awesome. Horns, in case you're horny. Bones right there. So, pretty, strand, pretty uh, straight up, pretty standard. Uh, upstairs, I keep my little open air working area for my furnace and the sand pit, or sand cast, and an anvil, a uh, workbench, flat rock and a store of latin or latine uh, some ores I haven't smelted yet and then the, the tower which will eventually go up 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 uh, I just kind of finished walling off this area here it's going to probably be more storage for bulk items like this I don't know what to do with all the hides <coughs> as of yet they're not part of any recipe that I'm aware of um, that's the general idea. Of course, I put another staircase on top of the other staircase in case I want to build another level. Um, but yeah, you can see I, I clear out lots and lots of area. Uh, make sure I have a good space between me and... Oh yeah, there's like a little wooden place over there. Anyway, um, so this is it. Uh, this is as far as I've gotten. I've played this for a couple of days on this map. Uh, I really love this game. I cannot wait for more and more and more and just just keep dumping it out and giving it to us because it's amazing. Really uh, really a magical uh, experience in this game. It's really good. So again, hey, I'm Skadoosh. Uh, see you around the forums, see you around the games, and have a good one. Alright, bye.